a couple of months ago, I, um, back in June, I bought a airplane ticket through Southwest Airlines to Las Vegas for my aunt's wedding. Got to the airport early and I just thought, hmm, maybe I should ask about my returning boarding pass if it get printed. That day I wore a, a mini skirt and a sleeveless top. Didn't think nothing of it. Didn't think people were watching me or scrutinizing me. Went to the counter, asked the, uh, the lady about it. And she was like, you know, I think that you could use another seat. I'm like, so what are you implying? And she was like, well, me and a few people, we've been observing you and we feel that you could use another seat. So that would be $179. I was like, excuse me? Like, how are you just going to assume that I need to take another seat? And she was like, well... You know, the seat you're sitting over there is smaller than an airline seat. So long story short, you know, it, it just took me by surprise that one, that people are watching me and just visualizing if I could fit in a seat or not. And maybe that's the time where I kind of felt kind of hyper visible, like unbeknownst to me, there's someone watching me and just judging by my body frame that I need to pay another $200 for a lousy seat on an already crowded, you know, aircraft. And, you know, we worked it out. Um, I talked to the supervisor. And another thing, I, I really wanted to lash out, but I couldn't. Because one of those things, like, you don't want to be the angry black woman, let alone at an airport, you know. So I was looking around, just watching and see people, were, like, observing me, see what's going on. But <clears throat> it didn't seem like it. Uh, talked to the supervisor, uh, went on the plane while they were boarding the handicap, so the aircraft was empty. I sat in a seat, put down an armrest, and the supervisor said, well, you're borderline on safety. We'll let you pass this time. And so, I'm about to cry just thinking about it. So, just like, I just never thought I'll be picked out like that, you know? And it's just, before I got on the plane, I was just thinking, that was the time I thought, maybe I should change my body to appease others. You know, like, maybe... If I weren't so big, I wouldn't, you know, be a hazard <laughs> to someone. But it went well, but it just left the bad taste in my mouth because I want to travel more. And with the whole airlines charging more for luggage, it's just Southwest is the only place that has an inexpensive airline ticket. But now I just feel like when I travel or when I go out, I have to be conscious of the space I take, you know, no, I can't fit in every chair, <laughs> but I still like being a plus size woman. <laughs> like I don't want to change myself to make others feel comfortable. 